Hello, welcome back. Um, last episode, as you can see, we had New Year's Eve. That's gonna wrap up in about an hour Sims time. Um, this one in here aged up. Look at her on her little pouty face and her silly oh what a cutie. Um, she aged up and this episode we are expecting her sister to um also it's prank day apparently i think that's an automatically generated one i don't think i put that in there but maybe we'll keep it jacob would enjoy it we do really need him to go to work i don't want him to get the day off because he had the day off last episode and his new year's resolution is to get a promotion so he really has to go to work we'll cancel this let's cancel that um, so today's Lulu's birthday um and then we have valentine's day in a couple of days i'm not sure we'll get to that but oh my god that means we've nearly played a whole year we've played a whole sims year like seasons wise because we did valentine's in one of the first episodes before lulu was born Oh, isn't that crazy? Um, but yeah, so this episode, Lily will be aging up into a teenager. Isn't that wild? <laughs> and it is snowing. Maybe it will stop snowing soon and we can finally get back to fishing. Because that was our main source of income and over the winter it's been hard. Here we go, New Year's Eve is over. Over, 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 over. Or oh, Marianne hated it, but everyone else was okay. You need to go outside. Come on, JJ. Oh, and there is our row of potatoes that we haven't been able to plant because it's been frozen. Maybe we'll finally be able to do that. I'm ready for this snow to end, guys. Oh, God, look at him out there with his bare feet. That poor, poor, poor child. <laughs> Come on, JJ. Woo! We did it! Let's have him throw that nappy away while he's out here. I'm not entirely sure how it got out here. And of course you're cold! Oh, and Fanny's up and she's hungry. Um, Let's have Marianne come and feed her. And then you, once you've put that away, you can grab some leftovers. Oh yeah, and JJ is scared of the dark. I forgot about that. How fun for us. But he wants to go hide in his bed. Why don't you grab something to eat first and then you can go hide in bed? Hmm? How about that? And there we go, feeding the baby. And she's kind of bored, so we'll let her play dolls. I think we'll just put her down. It's so early, I don't want them to be up yet. <laughs> Everyone's kind of awake. I'll send you back to bed once you finish this, mister. I'm not sure he'll stay there because he's so tired, but not tired. He's so scared. He's not tired, <laughs> but um, we'll see. Let's see. You leave that baby alone. Leave the baby. Oh, change her outfit. Okay, put her in her actual outfit. We're gonna we're gonna put it down. Okay. Let's see. You go play dolls. Can we do do do? No, Marianne's gonna change her outfit. Let's have Jacob get up and change her outfit. Last episode we had some weird glitch where um, Jacob kept putting her in light, really brightly coloured modern hoodies and jeans. It was very weird. Um, so hopefully that's fixed itself now because it was very annoying. <laughs> right, you pop that baby down, mister. You come and play dolls. You come and have a quick bath. You don't grab leftovers. You can make some breakfast since everybody's up. Let's have eggs and toast. Nope, and Lulu's awake. Lulu also wants a bath. But Lulu didn't have anywhere to be today, so she can wait till her dad's finished. She has queued up to talk to Fanny though, which is kind of cute. Can you play peekaboo? That sounds adorable. Oh, ho ho. Oh, it is. Okay, yep, Jacob has work in an hour. Wait, 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 where are you going? He's going off to stretch, because he's an active boy. Um, 
Marianne's just dishing that up, I think. Yeah, so you come and grab some of that. You come and have a bath. You're fine. You're fine. Okay, why don't you two do something together? Where are you going? Chat with Marianne. Are we just leaving the baby up here? No, you can come and talk to your sister. Oh, and Lulu's... Lulu's social level 10. A chatty girl. You can talk to Fanny, you can play peekaboo with Fanny. And of course Jacob's come up here to see his favourite child. <laughs> I'm sure he loves all his children equally, but he is... There seems to be a special place in his heart for Fanny, bless her. We are eating breakfast in the nursery today, apparently. And Marianne just is not feeling the cold. Right, that's Jacob off to work in his extremely period appropriate outfit. Right, what should we have you do today? Oh, what was that? If we say something that we didn't agree with. Have we done our homework? Yeah, we have. Okay, I don't know I don't know what to have you do. Um why are you sad? Oh she's tired. Okay, um, let's have Marianne put her to bed. And you can... Can you come and help in the garden, actually? No. No, you, you don't... You're not smart enough. Okay. Um, can we... Shovel snow? That's something we could do. <gasps> Our bees are awake! Because it's spring! Our bees! Can we do something with the bees? We cannot do anything with the bees. Let's send Marianne out to bond with the bees. They are very mad. <laughs> and Lulu. No, 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 no. Grab, grab, grab. No, 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 no. Not salad. No, 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 no. There's eggs and toast right there. That's it. There we go. There we go, good girl. There we go. And I'll just drag that over there. Did we shovel the snow? Have we got to shovel each one individually? This is getting his motor skill up though, which is his aspiration. His aspiration thing at the moment is play on a jungle gym while playful, but we don't have a jungle gym. So let's just have him shovel all the snow. What are you up to? Can you come and check on your chicken? Oh it has it has some food. Um we don't need to feed it. We don't need to feed it. You can come and Pay some attention to your chicken. Give her a hug. Oh, the bees attacked Marianne. They were very angry. Can we plant our potatoes yet or is it still too cold? We can! Oh my gosh, okay, let's go plant our potatoes. I have missed the spring. Both in The Sims and in real life. I'm recording this at the moment and the flowers have just started to come up in real life and it's so nice. He's working so hard and she's just hugging the chicken. We cannot go fishing yet though. Maybe we'll send JJ around to get collectibles. Can we harvest these? No, Marianne's sad, but we could in theory. I might send one of the kids around to do that in a minute. Oh, and we have tiny sprouts here. There are strawberries! Oh, we have strawberries! Right, how are you feeling? Can we harvest? Let's sell. Let's sell all the mushrooms actually. Is he playing in the snow now? He is. You know what? He deserves that. Where are you going? Okay. He deserves that. Bless him. He's so happy. His fingers must be absolutely frozen. No, oh, no, no, no. Don't go to bed to cry. Just come sell all of these. Oh, who's this? Travis got... We don't know. You go away. Um, weed. We can sell some snapdragons as well. This has been a good day. Oh, and now JJ's got the llama corn. I'm surprised he managed to get that off his older sister. Come ask the tree if it's lonely. Were you cross stitching? I guess you finished. Um, would you like to start another one? I feel like this took forever as something that someone might might have done in this time period when they're Lulu's age, so it's fun sometimes to look at. Oh, we got a we got a promotion. But yeah, um 
it's fun sometimes to look at. Oh, look at that. We are rolling in it. Still not enough to pay off our loans, but look at us go. Um, I don't think we can get promoted anymore. No, we might be able to get raises though, maybe. Um, yeah, let's have him go to the loo and then we'll let him get changed. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, it's fun sometimes to look at old, old examples of like um, practice sewing samplers and things that young sewers did in the past because sometimes they're like extremely neat patterns, flowers, animals, people, things you'd expect and then sometimes you will get the odd this took forever, I hated every stitch of this kind of sewing projects and it's always a nice little reminder that people in the past were people. Describe your imaginary friend, why not? Wait, Jacob, where are you going? Put your clothes on. You can read afterwards. There you go, um, or you can read something. You don't need to put Fanny to sleep, she's fine. Um, why don't you take a nap though while you can? Oh, she's just instantly brightened up because Jacob's nearby, how sweet. Gosh, look at that. If that isn't the perfect indication of her two aspirations there, she's a creative and he's... <laughs> he's a bouncy boy. <laughs> Is there something we can find for you to do, mister? I think we might send you to the loo. And oh, you can have a bath, actually. How's your cross-stitch skill looking? Two. It's not bad, that's her highest skill. Have we finished? We finished. It's not good quality, but she is like 12. Let's create a copy and we'll hang that up in the nursery. There we go. Let's put this with her others. It's not bad actually. It's more legible than the one her mum did downstairs. She's quite a good little sewer actually. Right, where are you off to? You're off to clean. Sure, go for it, why not? You're off to play chess. She's shoveling snow. He's hungry. Is anyone else hungry? Not really, okay. Oh, she is. Um, Let's have Jacob come and feed her. Oh, Marianne likes fitness. That makes sense. She's a neat sim and the cleaning sometimes gets your fitness up, so... Uh, let's try this rice porridge. We've already tried the oatmeal. Um, can we empty that? Empty that. And then is this read a book? Book share it is. She wants to read a book at the library though. Not sure that's gonna happen today. Oh, she's so sad. She's sad because she's awake. What a mood. <gasps> the chicken has grown up. <laughs> We have a grown-up chicken. Let's go see our chicken. Where is she? Chicken? She's a brown chicken. Let's go and see our chicken. Oh, and Fanny likes rice porridge. Okay, that's good. I think the only two things I'm confident she might have eaten are oatmeal and porridge, so let's go hug our newly grown chicken. It makes it sound like we planted it. Oh, can we pick her up? Does she like that? Oh, oh, how cute! Oh my gosh! And she's gonna go build a snowman now. You know what? Sure. Oh, and there's the notification. Um, he's off to shovel snow on his own. Uh, let's have Marianne bake a cake for Lulu. Oh, we can do a honey cake. Let's do a honey cake. You can. Oh, they're good friends. Um, you can come and clean up Fanny out here. Are you gonna finish this? Let me finish this, and you can help. Oh, nope, nope. He doesn't wanna. Come on. Come and help your sister with her snowman. There we go. This is actually very sweet of them. They get along really well. 
I guess that the age gap isn't too much between them, whereas between both of them and Fanny, it's quite quite a big age gap. Right, come and wash your daughter. That's it. Go and wash her. And you, you can put that in the centre. Add some candles to that. Right, there we go. Have you guys finished with your snow pile? Yep. Okay. Um. You grab something to eat. Oh, she's already on her way. You do that. Um. You can change her nappy and then clean her up. Can you give her a bath? You can give her a bath. Let's give her a bath. That might help. And then we'll bottle feed her. Oh, look, it's from hugging the chicken. I'll wait for Jacob to finish out here with Fanny, and then I will have um, Lulu age up. Okay, let's put Fanny in here. Once we've fed her. What are you two talking about? It's just after to spray the monster under the bed. And they've just become good friends. See what I mean? These two have just become best friends. Whereas these two... <laughs> you can bring that baby inside. There's no way she's crawling all the way back to the house in the snow. And you... I guess you're eating that. Once you've finished with that, you can... Make a wish. Oh, our first teenager! I'm excited! Oh, Marianne's just completed her resolution. Right, okay. Four skills. <laughs> I was thinking for Lulu, I was thinking neat because if we can do that as a teen, because um, I'm sure it was a glitch, but there was this weird period where she kept coming to wash her hands and she kept like cleaning. And it reminded me of her mum a little bit, and her mum has the neat trait, so I thought neat for Lulu. And then, here it is. I found a mod, which, as always, will be in the doc in the description. Um, so this is just a photography aspiration. So, your sim wants to become a real artist in photography and take pictures that have a lasting impact on the viewer. So. We will have her take this as her aspiration, and yeah, okay. Let's see what we're working with. Oh, it's given her some weird funky blush. <laughs> so yeah, if we look at her aspiration here, so she's got to take photos and then share photos with three different sims, so we can do those. Um, let's go and check her out in Cass. Okay, here she is, and yeah, it's given her some funky blush. It has also given her her dad's freckles, though, which is really interesting. I wasn't sure if, like, that kind of thing could be inherited, but apparently it can, so that's... Can we pick a colour that's a little... Do any of these fit? They don't really fit her, do they? Uh, let's take that off, then. But yeah, see, she's got her dad's freckles oh that's so cool <laughs> um so yeah um take that hat off and yeah i'm not sure that's period appropriate hair um so i will give her a makeover and i will check back in with you she is looking really cute though <laughs> okay we are and look at her, oh my goodness, look at our little girl. Um, she's so cute. <laughs> um, she's looking a lot like her dad, um, but our two eldest both have Marianne's skin tone. And I think Lulu's nose is quite similar to Marianne's. If I tell you side on, let me show you side on Marianne, see? And then Lulu, I think they have quite similar noses, whereas, see? So, 
she's got a good mix of both parents, which is always really, really cute to see. Um, this is her every day. Um, I tried looking up what fashion was like for teenagers specifically during this time period, and everyone was disagreeing, so I ended up just looking at photographs, honestly. There were a lot of people saying that teenagers just wore kind of miniature versions of what their parents were wearing, and then there were some people saying, oh no 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 no, teenage girls kept their hair down until they were at least 18, you weren't allowed to wear it up. Um, and in the photos there was kind of a mix of both going on, so I said okay. <laughs> so I've kind of a mix of both with her, so she's mostly going to have her hair down like this. Um, one thing I did notice from the photographs was that big ribbons, like this one, were a thing. So pretty much every teenage girl I saw a photo of from this time period had a giant ribbon in her hair, whether it was up or down. So big ribbons it is. Um, so this is her every day. Um, this is her formal. See her hair is up here. Um, and she has a big hat. Because big hats were the other thing. Big bows. Big bows and big hats. Um, for your hair and your, for your hair. So that's what we've gone with here. Um, her athletic. Um, her sleepwear, this is exactly the same as her mom's, bless her. <laughs> her party wear, which is her formal just um, with her hair down. Uh, her swimwear, she won't be using that, but a good opportunity to show you that her legs are also hairy, like Marianne's, because shaving was not really yet a thing for your legs. Most women weren't doing that. So, she's not doing that. Uh, this is her hot weather. Um, this is her formal hat again. It makes another appearance here. And then this is just her everyday outfit. So it's a bit of a mishmash. And then her cold weather. I really love this for her, this outfit. I kind of wanted to use it for more than just this one. But, I don't know, It just it's a coat. It screams cold weather to me. It's a little bit glitchy around here. Oh, whoa, 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 I did not mean to spin her around like that. It's a little glitchy around here. I'm hoping that once we start playing, that's not such an issue, but it is a really good outfit. I kind of, for Lulu, thought, um, I felt, felt like she was a hair as short as possible and suits kind of girl, but, um, we'll see. We'll see if that's who she becomes. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, this is Lulu. Let's hop back into playing, and I will see if I can get her to quit school. I've, um, had trouble with MC Command Centre getting the quit school aspect of it to work in the past, so I've downloaded a new mod that's literally just, you can quit school, and I'm going to see if I can get that working now, so let's go see. Oh, Lulu's just on the floor there. Um, so if we come to here, not Lulu, Fanny. Fanny's on the floor. Um, right, if we go here, quit school. Let's see if that works. Just ignore, ignore the phone there for a moment. Lulu has quit school! Yay! Okay. Um, Right, um, let's see what's the matter with everybody. Right, you're tired, you're kind of tired, you're tired, you're tired, you're tired? Yeah, you're tired. Um, let's have Marianne put you to bed. You can put that away and clean that up. Um, you can go to bed and you can finish eating that and then you can go to bed too. There are just books all over the place. I have to have someone to sort that up at some point. Oh, we're coming out here to get all of the rubbish out here too. How sweet. Let's have Marianne go to the loo quickly. 
And then while she's out here, she can grab this and throw it away. Oh, I forgot. Now we have two neat sims. Everything's just going to be... They're just going to both be constantly cleaning. I suppose that's not the worst. <laughs> here she goes. Put that in the bin. And then we'll send her to bed too. Why aren't you in bed? Go to bed. There we go. Let me get some sleep. I think we'll play through one more day. And then we'll save Valentine's and Lulu's birthday for next episode. I tend to play through like two days most of these episodes I found which is handy because that's about a year in this challenge so oh gosh if you look at her down here she's got the same face shape as her mom look oh ho, ho, that's so sweet okay JJ's up at 3am he's hungry it's 3am JJ uh -huh. let's come and grab some leftovers and then we'll probably send him back to bed so that he's not tired for school. Because he does still have school until he's a bit older. It was a legal requirement during this time period. At least in the UK. Not sure about the US actually off the top of my head. I'd imagine it was similar. Okay, she's hungry. Um, let's have Marianne come and feed her. Oh ho ho, we have a fear. It feels like it has been forever since Marianne has been romantic with her partner. It could be paranoia, it could be anxiety or a gut feeling, but Marianne can't help but wonder what her partner is up to or who they are seeing behind her back. Oh, Marianne. She needs to talk about that with Jacob. Marianne, sweet pea, he adores you. But I guess that is a rational fear. They haven't really done anything romantic since... The baby was born probably, have they? Is anyone else hungry? Yeah, we'll just have her make breakfast. 4am breakfast. Make some toast again. Um, you clean out this bowl of food. Is she- what the actual- What? Did you guys see that? <laughs> that was the most horrifying glitch. Um. Right, okay, you need to go to the toilet. Um, I think she just got surprised that Lulu saw her in the bath, even though she brought Lulu out there. Um, Alright, you come use the toilet, and then you can bring Lulu in. Oh, look at them. Uh, she really, really, really needs the toilet as well. Um. Okay, you're done. Grab that baby, put her down there. When you're done out here, you can come and grab something to eat. You can go to the loo. You clean her up. There you go, change her nappy. And then you can grab something to eat. Oh, he's gonna go and tell a story to the snowman. I didn't know that was an option. Oh god, the toilet's broken. Right, okay, um... Marianne's on her way out here to talk with JJ, so we'll have her fix it anyway when she's done that. When she's finished her breakfast, she can fix the loo. Hopefully he can hold it till he gets to school. Oh, he's playing peekaboo with Fanny. How is Fanny? Oh, she's doing great. She's feeling very wiggly. <laughs> you can put that away. Oh, we can evolve this. Let's evolve our roses, let's water everything, and sell everything. Um, she's cleaning up everything. And she's finally having that bath. <laughs> He's gonna inch his way to school, oh bless him. I hope he makes it. <laughs> Where's he gonna be smelly for school? Right, I think we might try the photography with Lulu today. Um, you can repair that when you're done in there. Uh, let me grab the camera. Here it is. Um, so it's only one square, but I put it up in here, and the problem I had was even though it's only one square like this, it does actually still block them from coming out of here. 
so even if I put it like this it kind of views it as like a whole a whole thing so I can't use it all the time I can't have it up like permanently because it gets in the way put it there maybe right let's have take photo of oh gosh they're both busy um let's wait for oh he's finished okay let's take some photos of our dad take photo of jacob let's see if we can make this work oh we can sell our homeworks we don't need those and here he comes i'll have him put fanny to bed in a minute because she's just fallen asleep on the kitchen floor bless her right okay doesn't this look so very victorian <laughs> It also could be fun to have some pictures that we can pass down. Um, generations, can we? Yes. Yes, we can. Right, do we want CPO or do we want a Vignette? Mm, let's go for Vignette. Mm, I don't know. That's kind of probably more period appropriate, isn't it? Right, let's get some pictures of him. She really just needs to get her skill up, honestly, so. Let me get a photo. Oh, no, we don't want Jacob to take photos. Let me get a photo of both our parents together. And sit, Maria. You finish with that. Come and pose for a photo. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, look at them. There we go. Okay, um, you can put Fanny up here. Um, let's have a look at those pictures. Outstanding! Oh, she's got a knack for this! Um, seeing we can sell to publication, so let's do that. I'm not sure what publication's buying pictures of her parents but <laughs> Jacob Junior's P class gets to run laps. Uh honestly I don't think he'd hide out. He's an active sim so he'll keep running. And he got a performance game for the personal best time, oh bless him. Right, let's sell uh... should we keep one? Let's keep that one. Sell so... Sell. Sell. Let's pop this one up. Can we still access this if we put that there? Oh! Just comes down and smooches her. He's feeling very flirty. This might be a good time to tell him you're worried he's not being faithful. <laughs> uh, why would that be? Deep thoughts? No. Affection, small talk. Right, where where is that? Under the romantic, makes sense. Okay, uh, affection. Talk about relationship here. There we go. You can do that. Excuse me, flirty Mister. That was a big old surprise smooch. <laughs> do you still love me? Oh, they're gonna do it in front of Lou. Oh, that's awkward. Lou, Lou, come and do something else. Come and... Come over here and make a snow angel. Marianne put herself forward and opened up a line of communication, but the problems aren't over. Maybe another day of communication and her worries will finally help overcome her fears. They are, they are messing around though now. <laughs> and they're flirting all by themselves next to this snowman, the slightly horrific snowman. And <laughs> Lulu's just in the background making a snow angel. <laughs> They're just flirting. They are just fl and then he's off. Oh my gosh. And Fanny's off, I guess. Um, <laughs> gosh, 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 gosh. <laughs> Fanny's hungry. Um, Let's feed her down here. Let's give her some porridge. Oatmeal. 
Oh, it's forgotten we tried the oatmeal. That's another glitch I keep getting. Um, let's try that again. Are you two having a snowball fight? I leave you alone for two seconds. <laughs> That's kind of adorable, though. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I swear his silliness has rubbed off on all three kids, and it's it's great. It's really nice to see. I wonder how long that will last. Oh. Oh, now she's unhappy because he dunked her in the head. Nailed in the face. She's laughing, but she's 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 hurt. It looks like she's got him in the face as well. Fanny disliked oatmeal. I swear she liked it before. Oh, that's annoying. <laughs> right, right. Let her out. Bin that. Oh, oh, our bills are here. Oh. Oh, it's gonna be nearly all our money. <laughs> Oh ho ho! Right, okay. Uh, Jacob, you can come and deal with this. Come and pay your bills. I'm sorry to cut the fun short. You can tend to the garden. I don't think she's got the gardening skill yet. I'll have to see if she enjoys it. There we go. She's just she's just got the gardening skill. And that's. Let's harvest everything. I don't know if we have any strawberries, but they're handy to have, and the mushrooms we can cook with for definite, so they might help make our food costs go down a little. We should check and see if we have honey and eggs as well. We do have honey, right? Let's bond with the bees and collect honey, and then let's come and check in on our chicken. And oh, we do, we have eggs. We have our first ever eggs from our new chicken. Oh, he's come up here to press kisses on the sleepy fanny. Come and have a bath. He's got this look. I'm feeling close to someone in my same wavelength. It's a literal baby. <laughs> oh, bless. Right, she wants to play chess. Oh gosh, why is there a giant puddle here? Is something broken? Is this broken? No. No, okay. Oh, was that because Fanny was playing around here earlier? Was she playing in the sink or something? Mm. Right, why don't you do that? And then you can read something. She's just recovered from being smacked in the face and I'm about to have her get stung by bees. This poor girl. See? Ow, bees. Ow. I've never managed to get a beehive to, like, be super friendly. Are they pollinating our plants for us? Look at all of these bees! Well, that's nice of them, at least. I hope that's what they were doing. <laughs> right, we're here to give our chicken a hug and collect her eggs. Our first ever egg! We got one egg. And it's a normal egg. <laughs> That's good. That's... We can do things with normal eggs. Oh, Mary Ann's coming. To mop? What are you mopping? Why is there a puddle there? I have no idea why there's a puddle there. But, um... Oh my god, we can go fishing! Oh my god, Jacob. Jacob, 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 Jacob. <laughs> Stop what you're doing. Go fish go fishing. It's not it's not freezing. We can see it moving. I suppose maybe these are little bits of ice. We can see it moving. We go fish together with Marianne, will that work? No. No it won't. Oh my god. That's so frustrating. It's literally moving. Oh my god. Tomorrow, for sure, we can go fishing. Right, let's set a frame on this picture. Add a frame. Let's add a wooden frame. There you go. Let's put it just right, right where it was taken. Right there. <laughs> oh, look, it's so cute. Oh, JJ's home. Uh, 
No, you do not have the video gaming skill. This is why we need the freaking river to let us fish in. <gasps> we, oh my god, right, go fishing immediately right now. Um, <laughs> and you can do your homework. Do your homework. Um, you can take a nap. She's having a fun time cleaning. Um, you can take a bath while you're out here. You can clean yourself. Oh look, we're fishing! We're fishing! It feels like so long since we could go fishing. Oh my god. Finally looking where, like we might get to pay off those loans. I can't remember off the top of my head exactly how much they are, but I feel like they're at least... At least 10,000 Samoans probably there. We took out a lot of loans. <laughs> we are so severely in debt. Look at him. I'm so proud of him. You bring back the good fish money for your family. Who are your family? She's having a great time in the bath, but she's kind of hungry. Let's have Lulu cook dinner. Let's have her do a salad. That's safe. JJ's done his homework. He's gonna come listen to music. Not alternative music though, that doesn't... No, 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 no. You can listen to classical music, Esther. Oh, he wants to go and play dolls. You know what? Sure, go and play dolls. Lulu's got the cooking skill. And it's gonna be so handy having her around, honestly. Maybe Marianne will be a little less run off her feet. You can stop fishing, come and grab some salad. Let's see, you caught... Oh, you have all these collectibles we haven't sold. Alright, let's sell all of these frogs. Are you cleaning? She's cleaning. Grab some salad. Oh, okay. Grab, grab, grab some to eat. Alright, I'm gonna go sell that My Sims trophy. Why is everyone eating in the nursery again? Can you guys at least talk if you're gonna both eat out here? No? Oh, wait, no, she's... She's gonna go clean that up and then come back, I think. Oh god, Fanny's hungry. Right, um... Lou, can you come up here and feed your sister? See, this is what I mean. It's gonna be so handy having her around. Because it means that Marianne doesn't have to do quite everything. Oh, what a good sister. Right, you can fix that. Are they flirting again? They are. They are flirting. She wants to ask him on a date. Maybe we'll do that for Valentine's Day, like we did way back at the beginning of this challenge. He's on his way to bed. No, if you go to bed now, you're gonna, you're gonna be up all night. Why don't you? Listen to this for a bit. And you can go to bed at eight. And you can use the toilet while you're out here. He's getting tired too. Everyone's getting tired. <laughs> so Lulu up to. Oh, she's she's just holding Fanny. You don't need to explore foods with Fanny. Don't put Fanny in the high chair. When you put her down, can you play dolls with Fanny? Yeah, she can. There we go. Let's have them do that. Oh, and they're chatting. Why don't you guys play chess together? That would be sweet. You know what it is, basically, eh? You, you can go to bed. Right? You can put Fanny to bed before you go to bed. It looks like, looking at their mood, it's that Marianne won. Yeah, chess victor. Are we surprised? He enjoyed it. He had fun. He had fun hanging out with his mum. She definitely won, though. We'll let him finish up out there, and then you can you tidy all this away, and then you can have a bath, and then you can go to bed. He kind of needs a bath too, but I think he can wait till the morning, whereas she really, really, really needed a bath. Oh, Marianne's just had a eureka moment, because she's a genius. She's kind of icked out out here though, so maybe we'll have either her or Lulu was round here tomorrow and clean everything. Gosh, everything looks so green, isn't it nice? 
What? No, we don't want to travel anywhere. <laughs> I don't know what I did there. I think I might have sort of clicked on another like a lot over here or something maybe by accident. Let's all go to sleep. There we go. Okay, he's woken up in the night. Right, you can go have a bath now then. Maybe that will relax you. And go down to Fanny's up. And really smelly. I think that one might be a problem for next episode because both of our parents are asleep and they need to sleep. Um, so yeah, once I've got JJ back into bed, or near his bed, I am going to finish up this episode for today. Um, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give us a like. If you'd like to see what happened, oh, no, Jacob's got up to deal with her. Um, right, okay. In that case, bottle feed her. And then give her a bath. Um, it's 1 a.m. <laughs> but yeah, if you um, enjoyed and you'd like to stick around and see what happens next with the Fields family, then subscribe. Um, I post as often as I can. There's not really a regular schedule. I try to stick to a regular schedule and it just stressed me out. So, um, I don't do that anymore. But, I don't know, this way is working better for me. Um, it kind of means I get more out, honestly, because I'm not stressed. So, actually, let's have him nap on the sofa. Maybe that will help. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I hope to see you next time. Thank you for watching this video. Bye bye.